We can still talk about some baseball, right? Hey, this morning, I want to take you guys to Winter Haven, where Randall Thompson and Chris Denhart turned a simple baseball bat into a multi-million dollar business. Check this out. So my business partner, Randall Thompson, he was uh, coaching at Florida Tech. One of the other coaches were cutting uh, baseball bats in half to do a hitting drill, and Randall started collecting the barrels from the dugout, hence dugout mugs. He thought, hey, maybe I could take this home and drill it out and drink a beer out of it, and that's what he did. For the process of making the bat mug, it's, uh, we originally we take a, uh, a, a billet that would be made into a baseball bat, but instead we turned it into three barrels, so it looks something like that. And it's shipped right down here to Central Florida, Winter Haven, and that's where all the magic happens. The hand sanding, the dipping, the polishing, which gives our product an incredible uh, finish to it. And at that point, it comes over here to our laser team, and that's where they'll etch all different kinds of uh, MLB logos, Hall of Fame logos. Six and a half days a week, we're just cranking mugs out the door. Hey, check this out. When you order some of these baseball mugs, they don't have to be all about baseball. They can be customizable. Like you can put a picture of your pooch on one or even happy birthday, whatever you want. <gasps> Our company did really well throughout the pandemic. A lot of companies didn't, but we're very versatile, and our background is, is heavily rooted in e-commerce. Uh, Randall and I, we had a great conversation about like, what are people missing right now? One of the main things was connection, right? We've all been disconnected. And I said, you know what? If people are having tough times, we gave them product, you know, if they couldn't afford to buy it, that created a connection. And we've created that connection and that, just that, that aura around our company it's, it's unparalleled, and I think it's not only carried us through COVID, but it's going to carry us for years to come. Che okay, y'all can hear me. Check that laser workout right there. That takes about eight minutes to do, but I got everybody a gift here on Brightside with their names. Cheers. Cheers. And uh, the 10 Tampa Bay logo. Cheers in a different way, though. Right, we might bring Yeah, y'all don't want to do that. Now, let's, let's, let's... Let me see your form, your batting form. <laughs> oh, I, I, you know what's bad is that from golfing here in Florida, I don't know what I'm doing. We just don't like stick yeah. to bunting to do that. Ah, but they're totally safe to drink out of. I thought this was really this is cool. So cool. I really the little insert that was yeah. in it. Uh, if we take a picture, which we will do, we're going to take a picture of it, and we use the hashtag cheers to cheers. Charity Ooh. and hashtag dugout mo uh, mugs that th they'll donate a dollar to support the baseball community. There you awesome go. stuff. Love it. So you got to get does, one. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if they yeah. can yeah. see everybody yeah. got one. Jabari, yeah. hooked, he really hooked Great us up. Can you can y'all see that I right there? Uh, can't nobody see that for oh, Well, I know I can't. <laughs> Too tiny. Good stuff. Jabari, thank you. <laughs> no way. problem, guys. Great, Enjoy. Great, great story. Cheers. Cool. They're using uh, debris from the dugouts. Awesome. Go home and throw oh. back. Oh, that's cool. Very, you know, baseball to me is just so nostalgic. You know, anything with baseball, it gets me right, right here. You know, I just, I think about, you know, past memories and, and future and all that stuff.